All right, welcome to another video, guys. This one is a bit of a random one. I have no bait, we're out here trying to catch squid, and I've got a big rod in case we catch some, or we might catch some other bait fish on plastics, or possibly snapper on plastics. That would be the ideal situation, but it is an after work session. It's about 10 knots, so hopefully it doesn't pick up. It's definitely less than that, so hopefully the wind plays nice and we can catch some fish, but yeah bit of a mixture we'll see what we can get um, don't have bait so we're just relying on our luring skills so let's get stuck into it all right if I can land this bait that's been acquired I just chucked on a blackie start throwing around thought I might have got it this helped the dunk I was like oh but it is just a pike but that is bait so we have bait sorted now because the squidding was a no-go so we will take that, some nice toothy little dude. Um, I probably should have my pliers out, but that's hooked up really nicely. Oh. All right, give me pliers. I'll try and cast around for those dudes. That'll be beautiful fresh bait. Sorry if I decide to anchor up a bit later. I've only got the one bait rod though, but that's not bad. We've got one. Slimy little suckers, these dudes. Pretty gross, but we are on the board. The placky. A little bait junkie minnow. Pink and yellow. That's buying. Hopefully, we can find some snapper. I'd be absolutely stoked. Even just some pinkies would be great. I'm just hopping it along. I was doing before. Cast it out. And just little hops. Like you're fishing for bream. All right, might chuck this out, troll a little bit, see if we can't sand up some stuff since we've got some bait, have a flick for plastics and whatnot. Do a bit of an explore, flick that out there. And mosey on. All right, we're marking up some smaller fish. Um, but I did have a nice cluster before. I've been chucking the placky around, but not getting much. So we're going to anchor up and check out a bait rod. We might even rig up this one as a light little bait set up as well. Um, but yeah, it looks like there's a bit of bait around here anyway. So deploy the anchor and get rigged up. Standard running sinker rig, circle hook. Well, my standard. Can't get much fresher. Pin that in the top. And that should be beautiful. Looks like the tide might have started to come in. All right, I reckon this one might be on. Yeah. Maybe little, might be another little schoolie. Didn't really take the line, it just looked like it was trying to load up and didn't. Oh my lord. They're getting small. These ones must have just been born, like, seriously. Yeah, like that down there looks like it should be something other than. snapper might be a pinky if it's on I need to get that out. just look like a bit more of a pinky one if it's on is it not on ran with the bait dropped it Boing. that's a bigger bait <laughs> it wasn't too big for this one but we're getting slaughtered, so. Oh, snapper maybe? I have no idea what that is. Come here, it's going a bit better. <laughs> this is on the real light stick. On the big pike bait, interesting. 
we go over that one? What have we done? I feel like we might get tangled on that one. Oh, all right, well that side of it somehow. Not quite. Is that a little gummy? That's why you don't have a clip and stuff that's on there. Because that's just silly. That's just gonna suck. <laughs> Luckily, it's just chilling there. I don't know how, but it's not running off just yet. This is why you bring sinkers for lights. I honestly don't know how. It is so chill. Oh, I can see it like that. Look at it on the sand. It's literally just chilling under there. Just going, yeah. All good. Nothing matters. I think it is a gummy. Yes, it is. It took a decent size bait. Not happy now. There might be a little pinky down there. <sighs> oh. Now, <laughs> we put double hooks on this rookily. I'm surprised he smashed that whole pipe thing. The problem with double hooks for these on the yak is you can't. It's very dangerous getting the other hook. Not bad on the flatty rod. He's only a little fella, but he might be size. And if he's size, I wouldn't mind him. He's looking like he's pretty comfortable to be size. Open. Is that one gonna go? Mm -hmm. Thank you. A big piece of pike. Interesting. It's definitely size. Probably about. 45 from there to there, but he's definitely a keeper. So I am running low on the fish department. Now, is that one gonna go? Oh lordy. Oh, might not be. Oh, we dropped it. Hit it. And that one was running off good too. That bent over and ran so well. <laughs> Bitten off. Damn it. Oh, I think this one's already on. I'm trying to rig up my other one back. This is when I really want not a shark. I want something I can use as bait. Oh my god. We're getting smaller. <laughs> I swear to god, you can't get any smaller than that. That's outrageous. That is the smallest ever. Gummy. Ooh. I don't. It does feel like it's kind of tangled up like a gummy, so. 
That could be. Just did a weird run, that's the thing. Make sure that thing's on, it is. It's not real heavy. It's not really bopping. What have we got? Oh yeah. Gumbo number two. He's a bit nicer. Not too bad this one. Did run off a bit weird, but we did feel it where it, they kind of wrap up and you can feel it not really kicking and stuff like this, how he's wrapped up. Let me get unwrapped. Splash by water. Not a big gummy, but by any means, but we will take it. If we get him. Can we get him? That's not so grabbing. Oh, what has happened here? Stuck on GoPro. Very lucky it's not a big one. <clears throat> Definitely better than the last one. Hooked up perfectly. It's on a tro car hook, this one. It's got three type of hooks I like. Reedy's Rigs, Gamakatsu, ah, oh, maybe four. His Trocar and BKKs. Pretty much, they're my go-tos out of those four. Depends what's in stock. Other brands, not a huge fan of. Trocar would be my least. These ones are expensive, and honestly, you're better off just buying some of the other brands. But I've got some left. It's a much nicer gummy. The other one's still a keeper, but that one's definitely a keeper. So we'll take him home. That's our bag of gummies, which is not a bad little mission for rocking out with no bait. Come in out here, see what we can find. No snapper, but we did get the pike and we've turned that pike into a nice feed. So very nice. All right, come on, be bait. Oh, it's not doing much. Oh my Lord, oh my Lord. So small, crazily small. Oh lordy, this went off, like this went real good. A lot of weight, big head shakes, a lot of power. This could be a dream fish. So much weight. Um. We don't want to get this one stuck in the shit because it's got a stupid thing on it. Ooh, good edge shake. Oh, oh, oh. oh man, I'm real nervous now. Head shakes are insane. Like it's either a big snapper, it seems like a, I want to say a dewy, but that would just be that's insane. Could be a shark. I am so nervous right now. Could just be a shark though. We do often catch those bastards, but we just want to try and stay connected. We just want to see what it is. Oh. This isn't good. I haven't got the other one in yet. Oh, we don't have a choice. Just a gummy. 
Actually, I got way too excited for that little fella. <laughs> Why is he bouncing so much? Very weird. I thought that was way better. Just a little gumby. Maybe my drag's been done down. So it screamed off and it was nodding like crazy. Unless it was hooked. I'm doing the taily thing. Oh man. It's not a bad gummy though. That's for sure. The weight seems so much heavier. He must have been tangled. You can't keep this one. They've already bagged out. So try land him, measure him, and get him on his way. He just ran off and then I thought <laughs> the head knocks were like a good snapper, but I guess it was just a gumbo. That ain't a bad gummy. He's about. Once we bend it, it just doesn't make it right though. <laughs> I don't know. He's over a meter. Anyway. Get on your way, mister. You tricked me. Thought I had a good red. All right. We are going to call it a night. It is nearly 10. It's beautiful out here. Something massive just splashed off in the distance too. I don't know what that was. But anyway, we couldn't set our last little bits of bait anyway. So that snook lasted us perfectly. Um, yeah, not a bad little mission after work. So very happy with that. But we'll head in. Um, pretty tired. Didn't even bring out any food. So I'm very hungry too. So anyway, catch you guys in the next one.